Maggie to the rescue. Fashion show. Hey everybody. You can probably tell that Maggie's extremely excited today because she gets to go shopping with Barbie. What could be better? Thank you, Maggie. You can have a seat. And you might recognize this gorgeous model. This is the reproduction of the 1960s Barbie that I showed you in this solo in the spotlight video. Beautiful outfit. But I also have some original Barbie outfits and I don't have an original Barbie. So it's perfect that I found this doll for $10 at the thrift store. So now I finally have a model for my clothes. So two of these outfits are actually on the same page in an original Barbie catalog. Movie date and fancy free. I love that title or name, whatever you call it. So dashing red and blue casual dress trimmed with white rickrack. Full skirt has two large pockets. The set, $1.50. So I guess it came with the shoes as well. And movie date. And this says blue and white striped summer cotton with frothy organdy overskirt, bows, accent, bodice, and hemline. I love that they use the word frothy. So funny. And um, I've never seen this outfit that's pretty interesting masquerade i love that i'm gonna be on the lookout for that it even comes with the mask but anyway that's for the future <laughs> that's a wish list so um they came to me sort of packed flat so i do need to steam them um, i have a couple of other dresses one is a handmade dress and one is the red sheath dress I think all three of these are originals and this is original in a sense, but it's a handmade dress, but I'm pretty sure it's from the sixties. And I just thought that was really cool to see that, you know, somebody used beautiful fabric and, you know, really did a nice job of sewing a Barbie dress. I am going to get these dresses on a dress form and get them steamed and undress Barbie and we'll do a fashion show. Getting her out of her evening wear and into her day wear. These clothes are clean and stain free, which is why I'm steaming them and not washing them. Trying to get that pocket to lie flat. I'm lucky this didn't leave a watermark because it's better not to use a steamer this close. Her tag has come loose. I'm steaming her frothy organdy. She's trying on the handmade green dress first. I'm so excited because I've never seen these dresses on a doll in person, so I'm seeing them for the first time along with you. 
I think it's really pretty. It's a little big in the bust, but otherwise, what a beautiful little green dress. I think it might be raw silk. Maggie styled her in the red shoes. Well, that fits her like a glove. And she's wearing the black solo in the spotlight mules. I really love that shoulder detail. And here she is in Fancy Free. I love the color blocking and how the dress puffs out. And the fabric is really high quality. And I like the boat neck design, but I wish it wasn't quite as high up on her neck. And now for movie date. Pretty fancy for the movies. You can't spill the popcorn when you go to make a move on Ken. It's remarkable how high quality all these clothes are. Okay, so Maggie's making her decision about what Barbie should wear for the reveal. Well, Maggie chose the red sheath dress for Barbie and the green dress for herself. I think they're great choices. She said that the red dress fit Barbie's saucy personality the best, and I agree with her. And I have many more of these original outfits. And I also have some more reproduction outfits that are really nice. So I look forward to showing you those. And I did get one more reproduction doll. She's a bubble cut. So now I have two models. So that'll be a lot of fun. I hope you enjoyed this. I sure did. And be sure to like and subscribe if you enjoyed today and want to see more show and tells and restorations to come. Thanks, everybody. Bye. Like and subscribe. Thank you.